Welcome back to Sekiro, everyone. To the finale of Sekiro, in fact. Uh, you really didn't think I was gonna let this guy slide, did you? Oh no, I will not. I'm pretty well equipped here. Um, I can get my strike in. I've killed all the, like, minions here. So, I think this is not gonna go well. Uh, fuck. Why? Why is this so bad? Like, this guy is insane. Uh, yeah, anyways. This is probably gonna be the finale of Sekiro. Uh, I really wanna kill this guy. Are you fucking kidding me? But it's not easy. It is not easy. Here's what we're gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna switch out to the Sabimaru and I'll try poisoning him. No, wrong thing, wrong thing. Ah, motherfucker. I actually switched to it. Are you kidding me with that range? To say that this fight is going less than stellar would be a major understatement. Come on, he has insane range. This is the closest I've ever been though. So Sabimaru doesn't work on him, which is a little bit of a shame. That is some bullshit. Come on, game. Come on, you gotta let me have this. You gotta let me have this. Are you fucking kidding me? What are these hitboxes? Hit and run. Hit and run. I'm gonna use my last pellet as well. Let's fuck it. Eat shit, bitch. Ah. <sighs> Final boss is nothing compared to this. I swear to God. That was insane. That was like the most difficult thing I've ever done in this game. Um, I don't even know what to say. Watch me die to this guy. Alright. Yeah, that's exactly what's gonna happen. Let's go back to the actual final boss. Okay, we're back here and I feel like I didn't properly introduce this episode. Uh, this is going to be the finale of Sekiro. I just wanted to get that mini boss uh, out of the way because he was bugging me. Uh, well, the fact that I couldn't kill him last time was bugging me. Uh, really, this is going to be an episode focused on the final boss and you know what, we'll stick with this loadout. I really don't know if I have anything better. Let's switch out to Ichimanji double for now. And we, we can switch out mid-battle to the Moron Blade, which is good for the, uh, the Ishin phase. Uh, yeah, let's just see how it goes. This is the final boss. Probably gonna take quite a few attempts. As I mentioned the last time, the real key here is not really taking any damage on the Ganichiro phase. If you can do that, which is not actually that difficult, 
uh, you are in a pretty good place. Like that. That's like an ideal Gneech fight. Of course, that doesn't make it easier, because Ishin is incredibly hard. But... Told you. Like, half HP with one hit. But he does have quite a few opportunities. Sometimes it's better just to run away from him uh, when you see him do that. It does have finite range. This is a cool boss fight, though. God damn, he does a lot of damage. He does more damage than I remember. Uh... I mean, I guess that's why they invented the sugars. Oh, that, that was that. Yeah, because he had two versions of that. One where he... One where he does like a... Slash. And the other one where he doesn't. This is what we're gonna do. Uh, you can't really be fucking around with them sugars too much. Because see, you see, I almost wasted all my Gaijin as well. Uh, reduce. Ongo. Yeah, Ongo is the one to go for. I do wonder if Sabimar works on him. Unlikely. Uzi. Gonna bring the Uzi out. Or Tech 9. This is not a good location. You don't really want him to be uh, close to the edge, because it just gives you less space to maneuver. I thought he was gonna go for the... Um, that's really the thing, the slash and the... Oh, he has a withdraw. I remember why this guy is so... What the hell, lock on? Lock on? I can't even talk. Lock on. God, okay, this is about survival at this point. I'm gonna at least try getting to phase 3, which I couldn't get to last time. Oh, shit, he goes for that all the time. Insane. Like this is this boss is insane. Oh man. And again, like I said, this is by far his most difficult phase. He actually gets slightly easier uh on the last one, the fourth phase. But at that point you're just like, you know. You're likely to be low on resources and just trying to survive, so that's the thing that makes that part difficult. Okay, cool. I got a good Genichiro attempt in there. Just want to see what happens. Oh, 
If I can get through this phase quickly. That was insane. That was an insane attempt. Okay. Come on, boy. Maintain. Whatever you're doing here, maintain that shit right now. hate that attack. Why does that break lock on sometimes? That is by far the best second phase I've had so far. I'm gonna save the heal. That's where it all falls, falls apart. Maybe not. I'm gonna disengage. God fucking damn, he's fast. Heal. Oh, shit. Okay, I got the heal off. I, I, I kind of... I was just about to say I'm definitely dead. Uh... Run. Okay. Come on. Oh man, he is so goddamn fast. I'm dead. And that's how a good attempt can fall apart very quickly. This boss is absolutely insane. Okay, here we go. Don't worry, I didn't... Like, I haven't been going at this boss so long that I had to change shirts in the meantime. Uh, I was out walking my dog, I had to take a bit of a break. But, I did use the opportunity to look up a couple of trip... Trips? <laughs> Tips and tricks for this guy. Uh, one of them being that the... Loaded Umbrella is actually quite good for deflecting his, uh, shit, okay. For uh, deflecting all his, like, wind attacks. And it is! I know that lo Loaded Umbrella is quite useful, but it's something that I've not, like, Really gone for. Shit, that wasn't... Okay. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Comparatively, we're doing okay. Huh, he goes for that quick. Apparently you can delay that if you like really stick to his ass. Shit. Cool, 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 cool. Yep. Should have itchy manjed.
the sweep. That's a rare attack too. The umbrella follow-up sucks. I'm gonna heal. This should do it. Yes. Okay. Third phase. Come on. How the hell did I block that? God. Oh, shit. You know what? I need to... Come on, let me pause. We're gonna moron draw. Get out. Heal. Fuck. I need him to do the lightning. Because... Do the fucking lightning. I fucked it up. It's okay, it's okay. Still have heals. That okay, got it. Cool. Last heal. He's dead. I did it. I fucking did it. <sighs> Talk about down to the wire. Holy shit, this guy is so difficult. He is insane. Holy shit. Th this dude is by far the most difficult Souls final boss. Like, nobody can argue with me on that. Nobody can. I think he's harder than Gale. I, I think he is. Even though the Gale is technically not a final boss, but... I need to take a breather. That was... That was something. You get a bunch of new like gauntlets and all that. It's just basically like boss gauntlets and you need to like conserve your resource. Like you have one set of resources in between them and all that. That was absolutely insane. Holy shit, this guy is crazy. I think Owl is still harder, but it could be just because I fought Owl for the first time. Our father, I mean. <sighs> Let's see if I got the correct ending. At this point, I don't even care. Like, this is the real ending. The fact that you beat this fucker. I think this one, right? Yeah, I think this is... 
Hopefully I didn't like fuck it up or anything. I've not seen this before though. If this is the new ending, I've not seen it. I think this is the one where we die and he lives. The other one is he dies, we live. That Moron Blade looks pretty cool. Yep. Pretty anime. Okay, I was just about to say. Sorry, I'm like engrossed in this ending. そして死のうと思います。我が忍びがそうしてくれたように。エマドのにもお世話になりました。Isn't there just like a cliff that way? Oh no, 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 there is a bridge. Okay, never mind. I think that's a pretty good ending, yeah. Like, as far as Souls endings go, uh, there are ones where you have uh, options which are a lot less, like, good. Like, where both of them are kind of shitty. Most of them, actually. Like, sure, Sekiro dies, but, you know, you rescue the kid. I think that's a pretty, that's about as good an ending as you can get for one of these games. I mean, the, it's all about the kid really, isn't it? And I know there's the third one, which is just reading how to do that shit uh, made my head hurt. You need to be like very specific at very specific points in the game. Super convoluted, I don't even know how the hell you're supposed to figure that out. And I think that means both of, both of them survive uh, or something. But, you know, again, like, as far as Souls endings go, that's pretty good. And with that ends my second ever playthrough of Sekiro. Not just on... Ch no, actually, my third playthrough and second on the channel. Um, I still think this game is really good. I know people, as I've said, uh, people are kind of still to this day a little bit divided on the game. And I have my share of criticisms for it. I still think that this game... Uh, does lack replay value versus the other, other Souls games. But what's there is like laser focused and extremely good. Like this game does what it sets out to do. Nothing more, nothing less. Um, it's, an, it's, a, it's a great game. It's a very well crafted experience. Uh, I'm gonna intermittently play this game on the channel. Again, obviously doesn't have the true replay value of Souls games just because it doesn't have builds and shit, but 
it's excellent. I love this game. I, love, I really enjoyed this second playthrough. And I hope you did as well. Uh, that's about it. That's all I can say. This was a fun one. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this series here. Uh, don't worry, I got plenty planned for uh, what's coming next. In fact, I think there's gonna be a... The next playthrough I'm doing is gonna be one which a lot of people will quite enjoy. Uh, so I think the new playthrough is gonna start on Wednesday. Demon's Souls still continuing and yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys very much for watching. As always, like, comment and subscribe if you watch the entire series. Thank you very much for sticking through. If you just watched this one episode, thank you as well. Appreciate you and I hope to catch you on another one of my videos. Peace out and goodbye.